What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. So today I thought I'd do a quick little video on uh, what's in my cowboy boot care kit. And these products actually would also apply to people who wear uh, dress shoes also. You could uh, migrate this into uh, a care routine for those also. Now before we uh, jump into the care kit, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button below and ringing that bell. It won't hurt either. Now let's go ahead and find out what products I use in my cowboy boot care routine. Okay guys, so uh, first product we have is actually uh, how I store my shoe care stuff is actually this uh, Sterlite uh, plastic shoe box I got from Dollar General for like two bucks. I found it comes in uh, pretty handy for storing your uh, shoe care essentials, especially if you have a more simplified routine. So next are my brushes. I got my uh, shoe shine brush from uh, Kirby Allison, hangerproject.com. And I'll uh, link all these in the description below. Uh, so you guys can go on and get them if you're interested. But I found that this is actually uh, works a little bit better than the typical uh, Kiwi brushes you guys will find at uh, the drugstores or at like Walmart. It uses 100% uh, horse hair, uh, horse tail hair, and it's a little bit thicker, a little bit denser than um, than the Kiwi brushes, so it makes the job a little bit easier. Next two brushes are uh, two Dauber brushes. This one I got off Hanger Project. Or Kirby Allison, this one I got, uh, it's a Kiwi brush. The Kiwi one I actually like to use to scrub my boots with and clean them with. And you can see this one's kind of seen better days. I have a new one ordered from uh, KirbyAllison.com. And the other one that I got from KirbyAllison.com is for my uh, conditioner. I feel like the uh, brush does a better job at working that conditioner into your leather than your hands or cloth does. That's just my personal opinion and personal preference. Uh, you guys do however you feel like works best for you. For my polish, I use this little dauber I got off KirbyAllison.com. I found it works pretty well for that. And last uh, tool is this little bowl I got from Dollar General for my water for uh, cleaning. I got like a three pack of those for like a buck. So it comes in handy for uh, my water for cleaning my boots with. Next up are these two rags. This one's just a dish towel I put down since I clean my boots on carpet and polish them on carpet. Uh, I found putting a towel down helps to save the mess <laughs> and saves me on carpet cleaning. So it's just a simple dish towel I put down before I start my uh, shoe care routine. And this one's just a microfiber cloth. It's uh, one of the Mr. Clean microfiber cloths you get in a three pack for like two bucks. I found the microfiber works pretty good at bringing the shine out on your uh, leather. Okay, so the actual products that I use are for cleaning the uh, Big Force Big More Saddle Soap. It's uh, pretty cheap and works pretty good for the price. So I like that for uh, cleaning my boots with. Next is my conditioner, the Saphir Renovateur. And this stuff is pretty much like uh, liquid gold. It is like the best uh, leather conditioner I've ever used as far as uh, footwear goes. You guys can see that's um that now it is pricey it's all it's like 25 bucks a jar or something like that so you can definitely uh go for something cheaper like bic that works pretty good too but this is if you can afford it i definitely recommend going for the severe rent of a tour my polish is also from severe it's their modality or uh black polish you can see i kind of uh need to replace that here in the next uh two or three months and the thing I like about this is it doesn't stink like uh, some cheaper shoe polishes do. It doesn't necessarily smell good good, but it doesn't uh, have that super high um, stinky smell that uh, shoe polishes are known for. It's got like almost a sweeter smell to it from uh, the natural oils that are in it. And last is my heel and edge dressing. It's an Allen Edmonds heel and oil hit edge and heel dressing for dressing the edges of my soles and my heel. So that's about all the products that I have in my um, boot care uh, routine. I hope you guys uh, took something from that. And I apologize for the shorter video. It's been a rough couple weeks. So after this, I'm going to try and get back into uploading and uh, doing videos on a more regular basis. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, if you have any questions or want any kind of reviews about the products that I have, like uh, the brush or any of the Saphir products, uh, comment below. Maybe I'll do a future review on, um, more in-depth review on the individual products. So thank you for watching. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button below, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.